everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Claudia. Thank you so much for watching today. Today I wanna to talk about something that I've been loving lately and that is Wordle. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, it is a word game that has gone sort of viral on social media and you have to guess the new five letter word every day. There's a new word every day, you only get one word, and it's the same word for everyone in the world. So I think that's probably why it's gone viral is because everybody wants to share how many guesses they got their word in. It's really fun and I wanna show you how to play and also some strategies you can use to successfully guess the word. If you like this video while you're watching it, please give it a thumbs up and let's get started. So Wordle isn't an app. I am hoping they make it one in the future, but for now, it's just a website. So if you search for Wordle on Google, it's the first one to come up and here's what it looks like. You can play it on your computer or on your phone. I actually thought it was a crossword puzzle at first, but it's just six rows. So you get six guesses to get the five letter word. So if you click on the question mark, it will show you basically what to do. So you're going to type in a word and if one of the letters that you guessed is in the word and in the right spot, it'll turn green. If one of the letters is in the word but in the wrong spot, it will turn yellow and if a letter is not in the word at all, it will turn gray. You also get no hints as to what the word is. It could literally be any five letter word. So let's start guessing so I can actually show you how this works. So to start the game, you'll just type in any five letter word. It can be any word in the world. And if you want to erase your guess, you can click the backspace button. But once you type in your guess and click enter, your guess is gonna be submitted. So I actually started with about because it has three vowels in it. So I wanted to kind of figure out what vowels were gonna be in this word. So as you can see, A will be in this word, but it is in the incorrect location. And the other four letters are not. So the next word I'm guessing is crave because I wanted to guess another word with some more vowels. So I wanted an E and I knew the A was in a different location. So I put it in the middle of the word this time. And as you can see, that was the correct location for the A. And now I found out that C is also in the word. I also wanted to show you that if you type in a mixture of five letters that doesn't turn out to be a word, it will alert you that the word is not in the dictionary or the word list. So I will admit, I did not know this word <laughs> that ended up being my next guess, but I did get a new letter, which was H, and I eliminated three more letters from the board with this word, shand. Apparently it is a word more commonly used in the United Kingdom. Let me know if you are watching this video and you're from the United Kingdom, if this is a commonly used word. So with that, I decided that with my next guess, I was gonna use that C that we know is in there, but not at the beginning of the word and use it as one of my second to last letters. And looking at the board, there aren't a ton of letter options that can precede an H in a word. So looking at my options, I decided it had to be a W and thinking through some words that are W, H, A, C, I decided to go ahead and guess whack. And that of course was the correct word for today. And once you guess the word correctly, this little screen will pop up, which will allow you to share your results with your friends. And as you can see, it'll just show the guess distribution. It won't actually show any of the letters, so you can share it with your friends without spoiling anything for them. So I believe that the best way to go is to try to figure out vowels as early as possible. So if you can figure out a five letter word with as many vowels as possible, that's gonna help. A word like audio has four vowels in it. So chances are you're gonna get a good idea of what vowels are in your word. And you obviously wanna guess words with new letters on each guess to eliminate as many letters as possible. So obviously there are 30 squares and 26 letters in the alphabet. So theoretically, if you guessed new letters each time, by the fifth guess, you'd have 25 letters used, and obviously, you would probably know at that point what letters are in the word. Let me know what other Wordle strategies you have. 
Let me know if you play this every day, if this was your first time playing. I really want this game to pop off because I really want them to make it an app so that I can play more. Even though the guy who created it said he will never make it an app, I really, really hope it happens. So share this with everyone you know and get all of your friends to play Wordle so we can get more of it in our lives. I know this was a short video today, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.